Today we're going to be taking a look at Thriftcart's Color Discount Performance Report. You can find this in your point of sale reports. And when you open up the report, it's going to prompt you to select a single store or multiple store locations. For now, I'll just select the shop on Atlantic. And then it'll ask you to select a date or date range. So I'll go ahead and run this for the month of October. And once you set your date range, you can choose to select a single category. Or if you keep this listed as parent category, it's going to show you a breakdown of all of your categories. So for now, I'm just going to keep that as parent category. Once you select your category or keep it as the parent category, you can select which color discount you want to view. Whether you want to view just a single color discount, you just keep that one checked, or you can keep them all checked to compare all of them. There's even a button here that will allow you to select additional discounts that you've created. On this drop down menu, you can select which user that added in items you would like to view on this report. And then there's also a couple of other filter options. So I'll go ahead and just generate this report. And once I do, you're going to get this table view. So this table view, it's going to show you your store location, the category. In this case, it's showing all of our categories that have had sales during this time frame. If we just put, chose a specific category, it would only show the one column here. It'll then show you the quantity of items that were sold in this category in this time frame. And we can see our average price sold. So we see for cabinets here, we sold a total quantity of six, sold an average price of $22.33 per cabinet. You can see our average price before discount, just $25.67. We can see our total discount percent for all the items we've sold in this category, which for cabinets was 12.99%. And we can see our percent that was sold at full price, which for cabinets was 66.67%. With a 25% off discount, 16.67, with 50%, 16.67, and with a 75%, 0%. This report will give you a good idea of the percentage of items sold at each discount rate. So you can see whether the majority of your items are selling at full price as they should, or if more of those items are selling at the color discount price points. This report will be a helpful quick view to make sure that you are pricing your items at appropriate price points and to make sure that you are selling the highest possible items at full price rather than the discounted rates. Another helpful function of the color discount performance report is grouping by pricer instead of category. So I'm going to go ahead and select this filter option. I'm going to set a longer date range, so maybe for a whole year. And I'm also going to select a category. I'm going to go ahead and choose our furniture category. And now that I'm on this category, I'll go ahead and just generate this report. And now we can look at this report and see each user, or in this case, each pricer that has priced one of these items in this category for the store location. So we can see Corbin, uh, we can see a disabled user, um, we can see uh, Mneering at Thriftcart, and then Noah at Thriftcart, and then all of the items that were not created by a specific user. So it's going to show us how many items they added, the average price that these items are sold at, the average price before discount, and then the total discount percentages where these items were sold as well. With this report, we can tell whether a pricer is pricing too low or too high based on the percentages that we are seeing that are sold at the specific discount rates. So if somebody is pricing a bunch of furniture and um, you know 75% of it is selling at 75% off, that might be a problem. That might mean that our pricers are pricing these items at too high of a price. Our customers are waiting until they reach a higher discount rate before purchasing. Or if 100% is being sold at full price, that might mean that these items are being priced too low. So all of our customers are purchasing these right off the bat. If you have any questions on this report, please reach out.